All right, hello, so this is this issue girl, Corinne Nicole, and welcome back to my channel. This is the 12 Days of Christmas, What's in My Makeup Bag? So if you'd like to see what's in my makeup bag, then keep on watching. Hey, player, what you gonna get hot for Christmas? Yeah. Yeah. What you gonna get that for? Visitors. Thank you guys for coming back to my channel once again to see part of my 12 days of Christmas and this will be the what's in my makeup bag video. Before you get into the video make sure you click the red button down below that says subscribe. Click the button, the bell next to it so you can be notified whenever we upload a video and make sure you thumbs up this video. You can share it. Whatever you would like to do, comment down below. Just in enjoy it so let's get into this the bag that i am carrying every day in my purse as of right now is this red and black um cosmetic bag that actually came from itsy you guys can see that and it has this little mask on it so i'm assuming this was probably in about in february or so on a mardi gras time i don't know so as you guys can see it's kind of not really jam-packed as it would usually be, but it does have quite enough things in here. So I'm just going to pull things out. I have this NYX Butter Gloss in the color Angel Food Cake. This is like my go-to. I have a little one in my lap, so bear with me. This is the NYX Butter Butter Gloss in Angel Food Cake. I love their butter glosses. Only thing I do not like about the butter glosses is when you were to eat you have to take it all the way off. Otherwise, it's going to be all over your food, all over your drink, all over your napkin. So you have to take it off before you eat or drink anything, okay? The next thing I pulled out is this little Real Her lipstick called Girl uh, Girl Power. I don't know. Called Mauve. And it's just this little thing like this. I actually got it in one of my Ipsy bags. I haven't actually used it yet. Um, I can't swatch it for you guys today because, like I said, I have a little one in my arms. But it looks like that. I have not used it yet. But that is in here. I have a mirror. This actually came from the Dollar Tree. And it's just a two-way mirror. I actually used this in my classroom in one of my experiments. Yet. But it's just a two-sided mirror that looks like that. And it has the kids right there. And I actually need to get a new one because the hinges are a little loose. Next thing I pulled out is this um, NYX Butter Lipstick in the color Ripe Berry. So, well, let me show you guys this. If you haven't noticed, the NYX is actually one of my favorite lip product cosmetic brands. And it looks like that. I love NYX. Oh, I got it all in my hand. I love NYX, NYX, or however you want to say it. I love their lip lip line, um, eyebrow pencil, and that's about it right now. There's some other things I've used, but those are things that I really like. This is a CoverGirl um, lippy. I'm trying to say exactly what kind of lip this is, but this is a CoverGirl lip gloss, and it is in the color Very Licious. So this is the CoverGirl Color Licious Very Licious, and it looks that so I like nude colors in my cosmetic bag. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Volume Mascara. It's a mini. I have another one of those cover color delicious in the color color delicious color delicious. In the color juicy fruit. So in my cosmetic bag, just in case I say I did not do my face that day and I need to spruce up to do something, I like to have something that's easy. And glosses are easy, especially these new color glosses and mascara, of course. So that's this one. All right, the next thing that I'm pulling out is this NYX. I mean NYC um, eyeshadow. Quartet. It's called the Metro Quartet Eyeshadow. And it is in the color 818 Union Square. So it looks like that. And it just has new colors. So this is just going to be easy for me to get myself together. New colors always go a long way. They're easy to apply, especially when you're just trying to get yourself together really quick. Um, I have what is this? 
And I lied a pencil. I could not tell you who is this by because it has rubbed all the way off. <laughs> so I have, oh, Essence. This is an Ulta. I think you can find it in Ulta. It's called Essence. This is just a simple black eyeliner pencil. Um, this is another liquid eyeliner pencil. So I have a gel one and then I have a liquid one that I keep in my purse as well. You never know if you want to get a nice winged eye or do you just want a tight line and make it all cute and easy. I have regular, regular, specular Carmex and this is in the cherry. You keep Carmex everywhere in the house. I have Carmex right here. I have Carmex everywhere in this entire house. Um, and then this is a long lasting. This is the Eyelore Brow Crayon. Super long lasting brow pencil. And it's just so you can get your brows on fleek. If you have not done your brows that day. Um, I have another MAC. Uh, this is the Wet n Wild Max White Mascara. And let me tell you what I'd like to do. It's not this one. It's this one. Okay, so I like to mix these. I will sometimes mix all three of these. So I have the Mega Volume, I have the Max Volume Plus Mascara, and then I have the Mega Impact. I have another one, but it's not in here. I actually like to layer all three of these together, and it gives me such volume eyelashes. So if you haven't tried layering them, try that. Now, the key to layering is to do it quickly. You don't want to start doing it real slow. They get dry, and it's hard for you to put them on top but as soon while they're wet go ahead and apply another coat of a different one so again these are those three let's see and like i said layer them and they'll give you the look that you're going for and this is just a nalu summertime peach and this is just a lip gloss nothing major just even if i'm i don't have the carmex i have this you put it on it's smooth and it gives you what you need and it's just a little sample that i probably got from Ipsy. So that's everything that I have in my makeup bag. I try to make sure that I have something that, oh, and I have a scrunchie. Something that's going to give me a face if I did not put on the face. Okay? So yeah, and then whatever lipstick I'm wearing that day, I try to put it in my purse as well to take it with me so I can touch up throughout the day. So you guys, what do you care in your makeup bag and what am I missing in mine? Let me know down in the comment section below and then make sure you come back to the next to my channel so you can see the next video that I will upload. So you guys, until the next time, bye!